Hello, hello, it's Agnes. Now, I wanted to talk about something that's been coming up repeatedly, and it's an, a really interesting thing. Those of you that have got a specific person and that you are trying to live in the end of being together, I want to ask you this, are you doing this? Like if you're not connecting, if you're not getting together enough and you're doing, you're making these kind of comments, oh, she's really busy with her children or he's really busy with his work or, you know, he's got lots of responsibilities with his animals, with his building his house and what you're doing is you're actually being understanding of these things but in doing that you're actually keeping you separate by not living in the end okay so you've got to imagine spending time together because many of you are saying you know they don't spend enough time with me or they just haven't got the time to spend with me but you're making all these external other things part of your vibration and in doing that it's holding you apart from them okay so try and really live in the end by I love how they always make time for me I love how we get together I love how we always have enough time together even though there's so many things in our lives his and mine or hers and mine okay so keep that in mind because it's been coming up again and again and I can see that it's a way that many of you are not having enough time with a specific person, not having enough time where you're constantly feeling there's not enough, there's not enough, there's not enough, there's not enough, there's not enough time together but you're doing it from a very giving and loving, caring kind of way as in trying to be understanding but in that bringing that in, they haven't got enough time, they haven't got enough time, they haven't got enough time because of this, because of that, because of this, because of that, you're still staying stuck in the problem and the togetherness isn't happening, okay? So what you can do to remedy this is you just live in the end, as I just mentioned before, I love how we spend time together. I love how we always make time. I love how our, our schedules just work and we always seem to find the time. It always just clicks into place. It's easy to find time. There's enough time. There's always enough time. There's always enough time. There's always enough time. There's enough time for me to spend time on my own, do my work, spend time with my friends and family and still have time for this relationship. The relationship just slots in easily. It's effortless, it works, it just works, okay? So I wanted to bring that up because it seems to be a real reoccurring thing in lots of emails and in lots of Q&As and, you know, I'm hearing this many, many times. So I wanted to bring it up because it's an easy thing to solve once you go, oh yeah, I can see that, that's what I'm doing and it's keeping me apart from the person I love and the person I want to be with. And it's my projection. Remember, everyone is us pushed out. So if we're being understanding because they're busy, they're going to keep being busy. Okay. All right. Just thought I'd explain that and hopefully it'll help some of you. <laughs> Lots of love.